Hey guys, HDV here and welcome back to a brand new video going over Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. Now, pretty exciting today because there's actually a hidden Pokemon in the new trailer that did drop yesterday. Now, this of course is not the first time we've seen something like this. In the first trailer for Sword and Shield, we saw that um, electric wolf kind of thing. We still have no idea what it is, um, but that is most likely going to be a Pokemon. And then again, in yesterday's trailer, there was more Pokemon shown uh, that's hidden that obviously wasn't shown as like one of the main things. So we're going to take a look at what they are today. So if you're excited for the video, be sure to drop a like down below. It really does help out. Leave a comment. What do you guys think this mysterious Pokemon is? And of course, subscribe as well if you're brand new because we do the dailyest of Pokemon content on this here channel. With all of that out of the way though, guys, let's get into the video and I really hope you guys enjoy. Starting things off, this isn't the mysterious Pokemon that I am talking about, like the highlight main point of this video, but I did see it when I did look through the trailer because I've seen this about 10 times now and, and I saw it and I was like, you know what? It could be potentially a Pokemon. I mean, I'm kind of reaching here, kind of throwing it out far, but it could be a Pokemon. So I thought I'd include it in this video because why not? So this is literally at the very start of the trailer, four seconds in. We see the female protagonist in what seems to be like one of the main towns. We've got like Big Ben over here as well, loads of Steamworks stuff. All these shops here, which again, we don't know what they're selling. It could literally be anything. There could be loads of new items in this game that we have no idea about that like maybe have something to do with the raid battles or the wide area or whatever. And then we have Steeny over here. And then that looks like it's the only Pokemon that you can see. Well, over here on this lamppost, we actually have like an advert. It seems to be with like loads of lines going up to this thing. Now, this looks like it has something to do with um the 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 gym battles and stuff like that and it, it does look like a, i mean it looks like a pokemon getting bigger but at the same time like i don't know what this pokemon is that looks like it's getting bigger now maybe that is just kind of the the i don't know like the signature of 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 this whole thing because you can see like the symbol down here which obviously is over here and that that is clearly the symbol for like the the um dynamaxing thing so maybe it is just like a little advert for dynamaxing or maybe it is just a like a hidden pokemon that is being dynamax so this is a brand new pokemon that is getting bigger or again it could just be um the kind of you know what i mean the the, the thing for dynamax i can't remember what the word is but you know you know what i mean like uh, just the big thing so i don't know what do you guys think about that i saw it and i was like you know what? it could be a new pokemon or it could just be the thing for dynamaxing i really don't know i just thought i'd include it anyway the actual main point of this video is two minutes and four seconds in so this is in the gym battle um with the first uh, gym leader with milo in the grass gym and they're doing the dynamaxing and everything like that and then we've got the crowd here now it's actually very very interesting i love the pokemon do this they literally just hide little things in the uh, the trailer just for you guys to pick apart take a look at but on this guy's shirt over here we have what seems to be a small squirrel chipmunk pokemon now i don't know um what this pokemon is of course it's not one of the new ones shown so this is a brand new pokemon that we have no idea about similar to rockruff when sun and moon were announced and we saw like a small kind of picture of rockruff in the trailer this is basically that now this is confirmed to be a new pokemon because there's actually another screenshot of it here now i can't find this in the actual um trailer um but on on obviously this picture here we can see loads of people with pokemon um we got score bunny over here we got pikachu here we got eevee in the background here and then here we see this squirrel Pokemon again. Now, it's very, very hard to make out what it actually is. But this is the tail here, I think. And then this is obviously the body of the squirrel. So it does look like it is a squirrel Pokemon. Um, I'm going to grab this and put it over here. So you can, can kind of see both at the same time. So this is the squirrel Pokemon. So this is on the kid's shirt, um, which is obviously um, there. And then we obviously have the squirrel here now if it's the same pokemon i don't know because obviously they look different this one's black and yellow this one's just kind of like brown with a black tail um so these could potentially be squirrels they do look like squirrels however though i believe that they could also be chipmunks as well i mean they don't exactly look like them but hear me out hear me out so obviously there's this leak um from the other day uh well from like two weeks ago that's basically been confirmed to be like true um because they got so much stuff right in the trailer that was shown in the trailer so we have here uh it says squova and greedon if i remember correctly are chipmunk pokemon who will hide in berry trees and attack randomly if you shake for too many berries if they attack you lose half the berries that they dropped so um i think that these potentially both could be those two chipmunks so one looks like this and then one one looks like that again might be a bit of a reach i don't know because they seem like pokemon that kids would have you know like little chipmunks i don't know like not obviously when you see like children in pokemon games they usually have like little pokemon 
um, I don't know, like lower stage Pokemon, the cute ones, not walking around with Tyranitars and stuff. So I think the Chipmunk thing could generally be a thing. And also, it's actually seen in the trailer as well. I can't remember where it's about. It's somewhere in the wide area um, where the... Yeah, here it is. So the guild's actually shaking the tree. Um, so I think this is when these Chipmunk Pokemon will appear. You know, when you shake the tree like this. I think this is what the leak is talking about. Because it does say, um, hiding berry trees and attack randomly if you shake for too many berries. So I think you can shake like once or twice. And if you shake too many more, um, these Pokemon come out. So this could definitely be the Chipmunk Pokemon and stuff. Um, I don't know. Like, what do you guys think about it? I think it's really cool that we obviously have these uh pokemon hidden throughout the trailer and that's all i can really see you can, you can kind of see the same kid there as well i think it's the same one with the same shirt and stuff but um yeah i mean there's not really anything else in the trailer there's something else at the end that i do want to talk about but i this is obviously the main part of the video so we have we obviously have the grass gym here um also quite interesting to state as well that the i don't know if it shows it here but the first gym leader does only have two pokemon um, I'm gonna put this into like um, I'm just gonna touch part this touch upon this in another video as well that I'm bringing out later like everything you missed but yeah there, there's actually a um, screenshot of the the gym leader and he has two Pokemon and his second Pokemon is um, whatever the, the the seed thing called I can't remember but that is level 19 at the first gym his ace Pokemon is level 19 so I don't know if the difficult if, if they're actually gonna be difficult games or you actually have to do quite a lot of stuff before you get to the first gym. But the first gym leader's Pokemon's ace is level 19, which is very, very high. Very, very high. I think that's the highest we've ever had for a first gym in any Pokemon game ever. So maybe there's a lot of stuff that you have to do before it um, to obviously get the levels up. Or maybe it's just a, a difficult game. Um, there's also this thing as well, like this Rotom, um, new Rotom form. There's quite a few new Rotom forms in this game. There's obviously the Rotom phone that we've got. Then we also have this Rotom thing as well that seems to be like capturing the, the battles and stuff like that. So that's very, very interesting. Um, don't think you'll be able to use them in battle, but again, new Rotom forms, it's kind of cool. Um, so yeah, this was obviously the main part of the video. Again, there's something that I want to talk about at the end, but um, I feel like these two Pokemon could potentially be the Chipmunk Pokemon, or it could just be the exact same Pokemon, and then that's just like a different design of it, and it's just a brand new Squirrel, and they've got nothing to do with these Chipmunks, but I thought it'd just be a cool thing to connect them all together, and again, kids usually have those kind of Pokemon, so for him to be wearing a jumper with it on um, seems about right, so... Who knows? Who knows? Uh, it also could lead me to think that it might be a grass type because all of these people are wearing grass. Uh, grass. All of these people are wearing green. I know that's for the gym, but maybe because this is on a shirt, that a jumper that is green, it could be um, a grass type. But I don't know. Maybe if it looks like this, it'll be dark electric. I generally don't know. So that's that. Um, I do also want to talk about this at the very end. Now, they didn't really show off this Pokemon because um, obviously it's the third legendary. They want to keep it a secret, but... They kind of just made you aware that it was it was there. So obviously the two legendaries are fighting, and then um, they kind of like feel a presence, like an evil presence coming, and then they go back to back, like they know something's gonna happen, and then they seem to like not necessarily change forms, but they seem to power up, ready to fight something. Now um, we obviously don't know what the third legendary is, but it's cool that they did show that because um, we kind of do know what the third legendary is if this leak is true. Now of course a lot of the stuff in this leak is true and it's been confirmed to be true like the gym leader and the, the wide area and dynamaxing and everything like that but um obviously we've had leaks in the past that have had truthful things like the alola forms and and with the alola leak we also had like a load of on that which obviously didn't turn out to be true um but yeah this person basically says that it Eternatus is the evil legendary. The other legendary will be a wolf who will either have a shield main or hold a sword like Great Wolf Sif, don't recall its name. So um, even though they didn't really show the third legendary, the, I, I'm pretty sure that is what is happening in this situation. The third legendary is coming. Even says that it's an evil, uh, is the evil legendary. And obviously if they're both ready to fight it, it's most likely going to be evil. So yeah, again, they did kind of show that a little bit. Obviously, we don't know anything about the third legendary apart from that. But yeah, they kind of showed that in the trailer. Don't know what to think about this. Um, maybe it is just the 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 picture for Dynamaxing. Maybe it is just representation of Dynamaxing. But of course, the main point of this video is this Squirrel slash Chimmel Pokemon. This is definitely a brand new Pokemon. Um, it's been confirmed. We've got like different images of it and stuff. It's literally like Rock Ruff and Sun and Moon. So very, very excited about that. So what do you guys think about it is? What, what do you, first off, what do you think about the first Pokemon that went over that like weird Dynamaxing thing? Do you think that's like a, a, a dip, like, do you think that's a new Pokemon Dynamaxing into something big? Or is it just the uh, image for Dynamaxing as a whole? What do you guys think about the Squirrel thing? Because this is definitely a brand new Pokemon. Um, and then of course, what do you think about the third legendary? I mean, 
I don't know. I don't know what it could look like, really. If it's like a sword and a shield, what would it look like? Maybe just a Pokemon in complete armor. Like, maybe dark armor or something like that would be really, really cool. But yeah, new Pokemon here, as well as, obviously, the ones that did get introduced. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, be sure to drop a like down below. It really, really does help out. Remember to leave a comment and like about everything that I just said. And, of course, subscribe as well if you're brand new. That's everything from me, though, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Have an incredible rest of your day. And until next time, peace.